Hello everyone, I hope everyone is doing well. In this video, we will solve a problem in which we will find reaction on cantilever beam. So, we here we have the problem, calculate the reaction for the cantilever beam shown in the figure. So, here what we have, we have a cantilever beam, two forces are acting on it, uh, two kilonewton and three kilonewton. So, as it is a cantilever beam, we have fixed support here. So, we will find reaction on this uh, fixed support. So we know that on fixed support we have three reactions, right? So if this fixed support, let's call this in position A. So we have AX, we have AY, and we have moment as a reaction here. So all these three reactions we will find now. So before starting the so, uh, solving the problem, we have to set our sign convention. So my sign convention for this problem will be this upward positive, rightward positive, and clockwise moment will be positive. So we have to consider that this beam is at equilibrium, otherwise, we will not be able to find the reaction. So if this beam is at equilibrium, so we can use three conditions of equilibrium. Some of the forces in x direction equal to zero, some of the forces in y direction equal to zero, and some of the moment about any point in this system must be equal to zero. To find ax, we will take some of the forces in the x direction equal to zero, which implies that there is only one force ax and this is equal to zero. There is no other force in the x direction. So it means the reaction ax is zero. Now here, one thing you have to keep it in mind, AX I am taking to the right, AY upward and moment anti-clockwise. Why I am taking like this? This is my assumption. I don't know whether the direction of AY is upward or downward. Whether the direction of the moment is clockwise or anti-clockwise. Here I have assumed and I will solve it and then later on I will come to know whether my assumption is right or wrong. So to find AY, I can take some of the forces in the y direction equal to 0. So what are the forces acting in the y direction? Ay itself. It is acting upward. So by my sign convention it is positive. 3 kN and 2 kN are acting downward. So I will take minus 3 minus 2 and that's it. This will be equal to 0. So in this case if I found, find Ay from this. So Ay will be equal to 5 kN. So Ay is the second reaction which we found. Now to find moment at point A, we have to take moment at any point in this cantilever wheel. Let us take moment about point A. Sum of the moment about point A equal to 0. So we have to write equation for the moment. Now, what are the forces producing moment about point A? 3 kN producing clockwise. So, by my sign convention will be positive. 3 times the distance which is 2 meter plus 2 this second force times the distance which is the total length of the beam which is 3 meter. So, there is no other force which is producing moment about point A. There is Ay which is passing from point A, so moment is 0. Ax, the force itself it is 0, but if it is not 0 again, it is passing from point A, so the moment will be 0. But we have a moment as a reaction in the uh, at point A. So we will consider that moment as well. Now that moment, here the direction is anti-clockwise. Our sign convention says that clockwise are positive, so and anti-clockwise are negative. So I will just minus, write minus m. And that's it. This will be equal to 0. Now from this equation, I will find m. So this equation simply I can say 6 plus 6 minus m equal to 0. So m is equal to 12 kilonewton meter. As this is moment, so we will use kilonewton meter. So these three are the reaction on the continuum beam. Ax we found, Ay 
in m 12 kilo newton to verify your answer let's say for a y just see whether the upward forces are equal to the downward forces or not now upward forces is what only a y 5 kilo newton this is acting upward now downward forces are 3 kilo newton and 2 kilo newton which is again 5 so which is equal to 5 kilo newton downward so upward are equal to rightward uh, uh, downward so hence our answers are right so this is how we find the reaction on cantilever wheel that's it